Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and to another Guilty Gear Strive video. Okay, so Testament has just been released. It's about 4.40 a.m. Eastern Time where I am, continuing on the Japanese developer's time schedule as I do. <laughs> um, and yes, I literally just finished downloading the update that contains Testament, so we're gonna go check them out for the very first time. If you saw my reaction, you know I think that this character looks super cool. Um, so this is very early morning and I'm quite tired. So we're just gonna do some basic things like I did with Biken. Uh, if you watch my KOF videos like I did with BGNA, uh, I'm gonna go check out the various options, colors, training, just the different movesets, play around a little bit and uh, just get some first impressions. So hope you guys are excited for Testament. I am, let's check them out. There we go. Okay, first things first, the all important color checkout. Um, yeah. Actually, you know what I should do? I'll put myself on player two, just so that you can see better, because I know my camera's gonna be in the way. All right, Testament. Where is Testament? Elegant Grim Reaper. All right, I wanna see the colors. This is, this is essential. This is a really important part. Ready? You guys ready? Oh my god. The second color alone is so sick. The white with the like almost pinkish type hair, the dark skin, and the like green. Okay, okay. Oh, the crow. Alright, I'm losing it already. Okay, this one's this one's pretty cool. The orange and red together do look pretty cool. Yellow, the purple is cool. Hmm. So far, it's definitely the white one is the best. <laughs> That's the Irish Testament. Oh, stereotypical, stereotypically Irish Testament. That's pretty though. I actually think that's really pretty. Okay. Yellow. Oh! This appeals to my, my little, uh... <laughs> girly heart. <laughs> um, alright. You guys already know I love that one. And there's pink. Pink is also very pretty, but you can't tell me that's not sick. Pink is also pretty. This one looks like a jack-o'-lantern Halloween type colors, which is appropriate. <laughs> this one's also really cool. Okay, I also do like this one. This one's sick. That one's okay. That one's okay. But I think, okay, all right, all right. I think this one is my number one. Probably, it's between that one and, let me get another color. Testament. Between that one and I think and I think this one are probably my two favorites. I don't know. It is just me. Two command normals. And stay in state. This they talked about this in the preview. We'll put them into stay in state. Follow up attack will occur when you touch the opponent with certain moves while they are in stay in state. Okay, but which moves specifically? I think I better go back and rewatch that video again, maybe? Um, okay. And so that's all that Stay in State is, right? It it makes it easier to put them into certain moves. Alright, and let's look at the command mode moves. Okay. Oh, I gotta remember my dash here. It's been a little while! <laughs> okay, so there's a regular... They're regular. But this is the command normal. And then... Okay. So, regular heavy uh, slash is this. And the command normal version is... Wow. That's got some range! Oh, shit! Got some ram vibes going on here. 
Okay, so then the other, like, just the normals. Okay. This is... Okay, this is interesting, of course. You could do, like, slash into slash. <laughs> That's okay. And then this we know. Let's get some decent range. Okay, we'll see if this could possibly be a good poke. That's pretty decent range for that. Oh yeah. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! It's like, get out of my face! Alright. Mm, that's a little meh. But that, that's... That's good. Mm, maybe this can cross up? Seems like it might. Okay, and then... be good as an air to air. And that's pretty good. That's pretty good. I love the animation! Alright, so specials. Horror forward. Slash heavy slash. Back one. Ah, yes. That goes pretty far. Now, the succubus, does that actually do any damage, or is that just... Okay. Oh, yes, this is the upward one. Okay. And it says it changes if you hold the button, so... Oh! So it goes further? And slower and stays on screen longer, so you can shake up the timing. That's cool. Okay. And then... Oh, the crow... Oh, that's right. The crow is supposed to, like... Let me see. Yeah, the crow. Oh, that's right. So you you keep. Oh, and then there's this guy. Okay, okay, okay. Oh shit! <laughs> you can't avoid me. Ah, block, block, bitch. Okay, but so the crow will go. Where the succubus is? Okay. Alright, and then... Oh, so you can do this in the air, too? Oh, that's cool. Oh, no, you can't. That's this. This. These can be in the... Oh! I gotta go in the air, too. Check out the projectiles in the air. Okay. This can be in the air. I already test tested that, so... <laughs> yes, the downward one is everything! Oh my god. Oh my god. So what was the other... That's right, they talked about this in the preview too, the... Okay, so say that... There's a succubus out. 
Wait. I'm supposed to go where the succubus is, right? But I can't go in the air, apparently. I'm fucking this up somehow. Or am I supposed to go to the... Wait a second. This it reappears in it if the succubus is not on screen. Oh, it's because I'm holding the button down like an idiot. That's what's happening, right? Yes, there we go. Oh, that's sick. That's so sick. That's so cool. That's great mobility. Alright. And then we've got these. Okay, so. That's so cool looking. But they said you can follow that, right? So I gotta like. Yes! I gotta figure out the timing for it, but... Okay. That's pretty sick, right? And that's pretty easy to cancel it, though. Alright, so that doesn't go that far, but... Okay. All right, I'm digging this so far. I'm digging, I'm digging them. Oh, this character is cool! Alright, I don't really know what I'm doing, but I want to play around a little bit, because this character is... Okay, should we do a different color? Should we do this one, maybe? Yeah. Oh no, I don't know if I want to do Axel. Zoner against Zoner? No, okay. All right, I'll play against my own character. Like, you know, this is actually smart. I do this a lot. It's a good way. When I get my ass kicked by the, the character, then I'll know how you should play them, right? All right, so let's do it. Let's see if I remember anything from training mode. That they cannot change society. So oh yeah, I want to see the intro. Instead of on themselves, they blame the beasts. <laughs> We're insulting each other's uh that's funny. Oh shit. Oh, see? Mine has- okay, so this one has like- Woo! This one has- Like, brown things. I don't know how I feel about that. All right, I gotta use utilize the burbla. Okay, this character is really cool. Uh -oh. 
Oh fuck. I don't remember how to do things in this game. That shit goes. Come on. Yeah. Did it connect? Oh, it did not. Okay, but that's pretty good. That slash is really good. There's a lot of. Wait, I want to see this. Oh, the colors. Okay, um, so I gotta remember to utilize everything. <laughs> There's a lot of different tools in terms of, say, for following up with the succubus, uh, the, the teleport, the crow. So I gotta actually remember to utilize those. Uh, it's kind of difficult though because the the other testament is also Mankind jumping all over the place, right? Society. So instead of and like my projectile can come up kind of slow, so if they jump away from it, then there's no point in sending that out. Though I could teleport myself to get away from any kind of attacks, maybe. I don't know. There's a lot to think about. Oh yeah. But that's no cool thing. I definitely like this. Oh shit. They did that to me the first time. Shit. God, I got reversal. Wow, that was good. That actually is pretty good. Kind of ram like. I wonder, do you just like a faultless block that? Finally, use the teleport. Do <laughs> shit. Oh shit. I got a they are, like, doing a good job with those. I think I have to utilize that more. Oh, I tried to do it at the same time as they did. Wait, isn't it this? How am I fucking this up? I swear it's this! Oh, it's that. That's the problem. There we go! <laughs> I put in the wrong input. Look at them, they're so glamorous. Purple eyes. 
This one has purple eyes. All right, I can definitely get get into that. That was sick. I don't think that connected. Oh, it did! And I was able to, uh... Oh, fuck. I did that to myself. That was my fault! Right up there. <laughs> I don't know, guys. This might be the one. Like, I've... Lots of characters that have come out that I find super cool and that I have fun with. But I just, like... I don't know. I kept coming back. I would just keep coming back to Ram. Um... But I don't know. I feel like this is a character I could, I could really get into. It might have some of the some of the spacing cheapness of RAM that I love. Oh, missed it. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah, that's nice. I really like this character. I'm digging it. Okay guys, well that was my very first look, a uh, very first chance to get my hands on Testament and just play around a little bit with them. And I really love this character. I think I was trying to say this a little bit while I was uh, playing, but... It's kind of been a thing for me in Strive, um, you know, I I picked up Ram very early on and Giovanna, and Ram kind of, I was like, okay, this this is more my playstyle, so I stuck with her more, um, and then I tried to get into Jacko a lot when she came out, I tried to get into Biken more when she came out, and those are both two characters that I really like, um, but my my issue is that I'd be playing them and I'd think, okay, well this is hard. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go back to Ram because she's kind of more in terms of my playstyle with how she spaces and the use of her projectiles, um, even more so than Jacko, who of course has a different sort of projectile altogether. Um, and I do still want to learn both those those characters quite a bit, but. Testament is the first character that I got my hands on that I immediately had like a similar feeling as when I first tried Ram and I was like, this is a character that I would play. This is a playstyle that I'm into and I'm just really like vibing with Testament. So I'm excited to keep working with this character and see the different things I can do with the combinations of all the actual projectiles and then following that up with the crow and or the teleport to move around screen. Um, yeah, so I'm really excited. And obviously, the visuals. Fantastic. Everything you could hope for, <laughs> aesthetically, in a character, at least me. So I want to hear your thoughts. Um, if you've had a chance to try out Testament yet, what do you think? Do you enjoy the character's playstyle? Do you enjoy the character's look? Um, or is this like a playstyle you're dreading having to play against? Or what do you think? I just want to hear all your thoughts and opinions so far on this character. Thank you guys so much for joining me, and hopefully I will see you next time. Bye. Oh, Nala's here. Wait. Nala says hi, and bye. <laughs>